that Kaneshiro truly was an evil stain on society. What's up, all you sexy people? This is Kakuto, and I am the final boss. Welcome back to Persona 5, everybody. Same with Kamoshida and Matarame, too. They hurt and exploited others just to satisfy their desires. So evil! Still, there were people around them who noticed their terrible deeds, weren't there? Well... A few people might have seen something with Kamoshida. Maybe not so much with Matarame, but, uh... Kaneshiro was a mob boss. I'm pretty sure a lot of people noticed his terrible deeds. I wonder why they turned a blind eye. Why doesn't anyone help? Because they're weak! And they're worthless! And they're not brave! They're too scared! So it's because they don't have the courage. That's right! We need to go out there and stop more criminals so we could give courage to those who are too weak. Yes! And totally not get rich! Aha! Humans are so weak. Hey! Who do you think you're talking to? You wanna wrestle? I'm sure I'll kick your ass, cat! Humans. I will pound that pussy! Do you think I'll really be able to become a human? If you wish upon a star... When I touched the treasure, some memories came back. I tried to force myself to forget, but... Wait, what? I thought you're trying to recall your memories and you're trying to force yourself to forget? Oh, are you remembering things you wish you hadn't? I really may not be human. Hmm, interesting. Oh, just be confident. Believe that you'll become a human. Who do you think you're talking to? A talking cat. Now that I think about it, I gotta be human. I am the core of the Phantom Thieves, after all. Excuse me, but I believe I'm the leader here? I feel like my bond with Morgana is growing deeper. The more and more that we argue... Oh, yes. Ooh, pick a pocket. Chance to obtain an item when Joker performs a melee attack. Yay! I get to steal stuff! Come on. It's not good for you to stay up this late. Let's go to sleep. You're not my real dad! My real dad's downstairs making coffee! Because my really real dad doesn't care about me anymore! And here I am, back into the Velvet Room. Our master wishes to speak with you. Heed his words. Oh, it's nice to see you again, Caroline. So, what does Dildo for a face want with me tonight? You've defeated the repulsive fiend of gluttony this time. <laughs> well done. Yes, you could say we thoroughly pounded that pork. I am glad to see you have devoted yourself to your rehabilitation. You are not worthy of such kind words, inmate. I suggest you treasure them. Oh yes, I'll take them to the grave. Thanks for your kind words, Justine. Do you recall the whispers about that strange man? Uh... Ah, yes, the other Metaverse user. Even a chicken could remember something that important. Don't sound so cocky about it. Oh, I'm sorry! Agreeing that I remember something is being cocky? My god, your Sundre levels are going a little too high, Carolyn! This is about the cases of those people who shut down, is it not? Indeed, I speak of another with powers similar to yours. Ooh, ooh, can I meet him? Can I kick his ass? I want to kick his ass. If you are to complete your rehabilitation, you may encounter him eventually. Yeah! <laughs> Yet another thing for me to look forward to. I get to make a new friend! Yay! I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. Oh, is it the ability to summon more personas? It would be greatly troubling if you were to not strengthen your abilities. It's the power to get more personas, isn't it? It always is! I stand corrected! Increases the EXP bonus granted by Arcana Burst. That's right. cool, I like it. 
Yeah, I get to strengthen all of my personas a little bit more. It's time, inmate. Oh, is it? Is it really? Oh boy, I love tea! Return to your world. Oh. Well, fine then. I didn't want your shitty prison tea anyway. Carolyn probably pissed in it anyway. So, yeah. It's fun, so it's okay. And justify the means. They're still thieves. They've always been fishy. They seem full of it, so I say no. Mm, hello, hello? Sexmaster speaking. It's me, Makoto. Oh, hi. Were you sleeping? Um... Uh, I'm still asleep. I am just very accurate with my sleep talking. I assume it's okay if you're able to make such jokes. Ha ha ha! I am the comedian, yes. There's something I feel I should let you know. Kanashiro contacted me. What? Kanashiro? What? He said he's calling off our debt. Oh. It seems he's disposed of all the photographs as well. Uh, <laughs> how nice of the... How, how nice of the great Fiora. And, um... My sister and her team have taken him into custody. Wow, that was fast. What? He's already admitted to his wrongdoings? Like... Seriously, already? I thought we had to wait a little bit before he did that, but wow, okay. It appears they did not want him to disappear, if you know what I mean. Oh. His group was called a mafia after all. I wouldn't put silencing him past them. Oh! <laughs> More for keeping him alive to talk. Oh, I get it. In changing his heart. Well, he did call up the debt, and he turned himself in, so we did it! It's hard to say for sure yet. Morgana, stop being a party pooper! I see. What about those psychotic breakdowns that Kanashiro mentioned? I'm not sure, but I assume he was talking about the incidents that have been all over the news lately. It really may be related to the other person who has been entering palaces. True. That said, all we can do now is wait until Kanashiro's change of heart becomes clear to us. Thank you. Hey! Hey! What the hell happened? I thought I was having a conversation with her. Morgana, you took over, you damn cat! Oh, fine. I think you may not know this already, but I've been ordered by Principal Kamoyo Kaila to look for the culprits. Is he on to us? Do we need to kill a bitch? Seem to be fine for now, but we can't let our guard down. I asked it to try not to stand out for a while. By the way, I usually spend my time in the student council room. If there's ever an emergency, feel free to come find me there. Oh, really? Well, who wants to spend with me now? Spend with me, spend time with me. I found a place, and what are we doing today? <laughs> Wait, do I even have the smarts available to go out with Makoto yet? Let's find out! Makoto, darling! I'm coming for you! Hi. Hey. I've yet to hear anything from Kanashiro. All we can do now is wait until our time limit. Hmm? Did you need something on the third floor? Have you come to study in the library, perhaps? I came to see you. Let's go into the city! Do you have a minute? It seems your studies have paid off. Have you been working hard? It seems I have an effect! Yeah! There's something I want to ask you. If it doesn't get in the way of your studies, that is. Oh, it's okay. I am truly the smartest of smarties. Do, do not worry about my um, studies. Um, I, I'm sure the night before the test and exams will will, will be sufficient enough. <laughs> so, uh, date now. Study later. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now then, let's find somewhere better to talk. Ooh, I know. Great. Never mind. Find the courtyard it is. Who's gonna take it a big bang burger? Hey, I have a question to ask you. Is that okay? Mitsuru would have liked it. 
Up until now, I've been the quintessential honor student. I believe I've been handling my position as student council president with ease as well. And I don't mean that in a boasting way, that's simply how I've thought about it. But in the end, I was unable to make any kind of impact with either Suzui-san or Kanashiro. Turns out there's no use for a rule-abiding honor student when things get rough. Now that I'm a member of this team, I want to do everything I can to help you all. Sweet! Just keep kicking ass like you always do, and uh, make sure that you always bring that very, 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 very tight leather outfit, and we'll be golden! All my studying up to this point has kept me quite narrow-minded. I think I will need to broaden my horizon somewhat. Let's see. What do you plan on doing? Way to go, advisor! <laughs> ah, why not? Let's stroke that ego of hers. All right. My first step will be to learn more about the other students. Are you sure you want to put yourself through that insanity? I think there's quite a few students out there who might, um, take that a little strangely. But I struggle with that. There seems to be a disparity between my tastes and those of my peers. Probably because you're the very studious young young woman, and, uh, well, you know Akito, so you can, you're smart, you can kick some ass, but, um, not everybody's like that! <laughs> Let's see, that's not true. You're totally right, honestly. I knew it. I mean, really, think about it. Not every person that's going to go to school is going to be going there just because they have such the urge for learning. I don't even know where people like to go for fun. Oh, I know a place! It would be nice to have a grasp of such concepts. I got a place I want to show you. Come with me to a land of opportunity! Plus, the student council must be responsible for understanding the student body they serve, right? I don't mean that in a surveillance way. I just want to know them as people. So basically your plan is to do what you did with me. Walk around with a book held high and uh, hope that nobody sees you as you spy on them. I may be a phantom thief, but that's no excuse for me to start ignoring my presidential duties. So, I mean, seriously, what are you going to do? Just go around the hallways, tap on people's shoulders? Hi! Tell me about yourself! Now, back to the topic at hand. Don't run away from me! I want to learn about you! Where do people usually go for fun? Big Bang Burger! Big Bang Burger! Movie theater, karaoke... Why is Big Bang Burger not on here? Let's see. Um, let's see. Movie theater is big. Karaoke is big. The arcade is big. Shit, this is actually pretty tough. Because in Japan, arcades are still huge. I seriously wish there were more arcades here in the United States. All we have is Dave and & Buster's and Chuck E. Cheese, and maybe the occasional arcade cabinet and a Walmart. There's karaoke, which is huge in Japan. It always has been. Movie theaters, that's huge anywhere. Uh, I gotta just say karaoke. Karaoke, hmm? My friends have taken me there a few times. If possible, I'd like to go somewhere I'm a little less familiar with. Oh, but come on! I want to serenade you with my amazing singing voice! How about an arcade? I've never actually been to one. She wants to be a gamer! She's a camper! You're mine! Do you think you could take me? Yes! I'm not sure if it'll broaden my horizons, per se, but simply studying won't get me anywhere. Ha-ha! Behold! I shall show you my skills in uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. <laughs> Let's go now! <laughs> Let's go right now. Right this second. Thank goodness. I think I would have been totally lost in there had I gone by myself. Oh shit, she's actually up for this? Well... Let's get going. Holy shit, I'm going out on a date with Makoto to the arcade! Yeah! Well, I guess it's not really a date, but it's close enough. I'll be happy! I'll be happy! I'll take what I can get! So 
This is where everyone comes to enjoy themselves. Damn right! We got guns, we got cars, we got buttons to mash! Let's do this! There are more girls here than I expected. What? Why? There's lots of girls that love games. Hey, over there! House of the Dead! Let's go! You play by aiming the gun at the screen, right? That actually seems somewhat realistic. Yes! Let's do it! House of the Dead! Come on! Wanna try it out? You can do it. It'll be an experience! If it's okay with you. Damn right! Let's kill some zombies! Do you think you could teach me? Sure! You hold up the gun, you press the trigger, and then when you need to reload, you shoot off the screen. You know, like totally real guns do. <laughs> Hold on, guys! I need to reload! Click! I did it! Uh, no way! <laughs> She's totally getting into it. Makoto's lab play is garnering quite a bit of attention. Yep, yep, gather yeah, around, ladies and gentlemen. This is my girl. This is Makoto. She can, she can kick some zombie ass. She seems to have been too engrossed in the game to even notice, though. Yep, she's hot. Yours is not. Haha. -ha. Oh, so this is how it is. Yeah. Well, what'd you think? You're a real gamer. Of course, that was just a game. But I wonder if I could apply some of the techniques I learned here during battle. True. It might help your gunplay. That might just work. Perhaps going somewhere I don't normally frequent is what helped me come up with that idea. You know, it may only be a little bit, but I think I'm starting to understand how people pass time. That's actually... That's both cute and kind of sad. Interesting. I would have never even thought about coming here before. I've got lots of other places I want to show you. I can show you the world. No, I'm not doing that again. You still have much to learn, Makoto-san. <laughs> that was a new segment. You really stood out. Mmm. That can be taken negatively. That was a new side of you. I... Hey... Do you think you could help me out again later? Yes! I might be able to give the team more ideas if I can gain increased knowledge outside of my studies. Ideas? I don't mind. I look forward to it. I need to live up to your expectations now that I've taken up your time. Perhaps it won't be immediately, but I'm sure I can be of use. I'm sure we'll find some ways. Next, let me show you how to- wait, no. No, she will kick my ass in a racing game. She already knows how to ride a fucking motorcycle. Oh God, I can sense a strong resolve from Makoto. We just hop on to cruise in USA and oh. No, I swear to God, I was the better racer. I was the better racer. <laughs> There must have been people who obstructed your actions as the Phantom Thieves. You managed to overcome them because you had someone who specialized in analyzing enemies. Isn't that right? Um, not really. I'm just a really sharp cookie. <laughs> I am thou. It shall become the blah 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 priestess. Shadow calculus allows you to see skills and potential item drops on the analysis screen. Neat. All right. By the way. You went to the red light district when you were chasing after Kaneshiro, right? Um, I swear to God, I did not go to any strip clubs. I only have eyes for you. M maybe on. Maybe my teacher. Maybe my doctor. I think I have a problem. I'd like to go there as well. Ah! No, not for my own purposes. Okay. Tell you the truth. I recently got a report that one of our students was spotted there. Ryuji? I'm skeptical, but 
I'd like to confirm firsthand for myself. Um, well, it's getting late. If a student go. goes there, I guess it's. Uh, you know what? Whatever. This is gonna turn into something really strange and wacky anyway. See ya. Hey, Makoto. By the way, yeah, you had fun today, right? There are these things called home consoles. Where are you going? Where are you going, Makoto? No! I want to play Smash Brothers with you, Makoto. Come back! Hello! Hey, you see the article? Uh, nope. It's an interview with some kid from school. Boy M tells all rampant abuse in the Kamoshita case. They are still talking about Kamoshita? Damn! What he did just stretches far, doesn't it? That's what I said. It's mostly about physical punishment. You think this boy M is me? Oh, Mishima's finally speaking up! It could be Makoto. No, it's probably Mishima. Guess it might be him after all. I mean, that fan site thing's been a huge help, too. It's probably fine to leave him be. He ain't doing us any harm. See you later. I like the dude! He's not doing us any harm, he's helping us! That article. Do you think the reporter we met at Crossroads could have written it? That's right! We had to meet up! We set him up on a quote-unquote date! I should check the article Ryuji mentioned. Just as I thought, the author it listed is Ichigo... Ichigo? <laughs> Ichigo the Soul Reaver! Ichigo Oya! I see, the article might end up being useful for us. Uh, how so? If the palace ruler sees it and his cognition of the Phantom Thieves changes... Hey, Kagano, we'd be missing out if we didn't use this to our advantage. If we have her paint us in a positive light, public opinion of us will change for the better. I, English. You should go try and get her to write some more articles about the Phantom Thieves. All right. So, here is the next big question. Do I have the yes I do? Yes I do! But first... I should write something. First I should write something. Uh, 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 actually, uh, just in case, I'll save it right here. Because otherwise that's a lot of stuff that would have been lost if something bad were to happen to my recording. So, um, uh, <laughs> oh. Yes! Kawakami! Hot teacher! Hi! <laughs> Thank you for your call. I'm all your... Oh, it's just you. Oh. Do you really think that little of me? You know, I've been hearing Shibuya is getting more dangerous lately. I'm sure you pass by that area on your commute to school, but don't make any detours, okay? It'll cost you 5,000 yen to request me, but this time I'll be sure to do an extra good job. Oh, really? Go on. I can afford it. I can finally afford Lord it! Hot teacher in a maid outfit! Let's go! What? What? You're really going to- Of course I am! I'll be heading over right now then. Why wouldn't I? It'd be helpful if you could clean up a little bit before I get there so it's easier for me. Isn't that gonna defeat the purpose of having a maid but at the same time... Fine, I'll be the suave gentleman that I am and make sure that even though I paid you, you don't have to do any of the work. That's just the kind of guy that Kagato, the final boss, begins. I love cleaning shabby, I mean sophisticated rooms like this. It gives me a sense of accomplishment. I had no- come, 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 I had no choice! It's literally an attic! If it's for you, master, I'll happily be covered in dust. That's... Hot, question mark? But then, doesn't it pain your heart to see such a cute maid all dirty? 
I'm not sure, question mark? Uh, I'll tell your boss! I feel... <laughs> <laughs> I almost, I almost want to respond to that. Like, oh, I feel nothing. Your, your suffering does nothing. Your joy does nothing. I don't care. Ah, fine, it does. <laughs> oh, master, even though your room is messy, your heart is so clean. Yeah, stop rubbing it in, Kawakami, and I just realized I forgot a persona to bring. I'll go ahead and get this over with then. This'll do, right? Keep it a little messy for the shabby the sheep feel, you know? And now cleaning is complete. Uh, thank you? If we're just gonna be going to that next step, then don't mind if I do. <laughs> uh, you okay, Kawakami? Teach? You dead? I'm not allowed to work overtime during weekdays, so I rushed to my part-time job after class ends. On my off days, I have to prepare pop quizzes and homework assignments. And today, I had to clean bathtubs and walk dogs before coming here. There's no time to rest. Oh, speaking of pets, this room smells like a cat. I feel a lot of I feed a lot of strays around my house. Oh, God! Morgana! Clean yourself a little bit better so my room doesn't smell like cats! I was surprised that you requested me. I didn't think you actually would. You're, you're serious, right? HAVE YOU SEEN YOURSELF?! I mean, okay, granted, your hairstyle is a little bit... ...strange, but... HAVE YOU SEEN YOURSELF?! You weren't expecting to do anything weird with me, were- NONSENSE! Look at you, shit! I want to ever give you that idea! <laughs> Okay, okay, yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, 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 absolutely not! As long as you understand. I know I'm in a maid outfit, but I'm still your teacher, so don't give any f <laughs> No! No, funny ideas? Funny thoughts? What were those? I'm, I'm, I'm as clean and as pure as the fallen snow! <laughs> Besides, I try not to get too involved with my students, so... I need a nap. Okay! Sorry, just give me five minutes. M maybe ten. Um... And before you know it, time's up. Thank you very much! Th this is what I paid 50 bucks for. Oh, hey, do you know any of the part-time jobs that pay well? I assume you make a lot since you can afford a maid service. Um, uh, so there's this place called Mementos, and, uh, what I do is I go fight a really big and powerful creature, and I make him so confused that he just throws endless money at me. Good, good, good luck with that. You, you need money? Well, uh... You know... It's for my little sister. Oh, no. She's sick, so I need money to pay for her medical expenses. Hello? Yes, I made the transfer. What? Not enough! But it was the same amount as last week, I... No. Yes, I understand. Okay, goodbye. Uh... Are you sure this is about a little sister? Uh, wrong number! Do you even have a little sister? Kawakami, what have you gotten yourself into? Hey, sorry to ask you this out of the blue, but... Do you happen to have 100,000 yen I could borrow? 
Actually, I have very close to that. Never mind. I can help, okay? I think one of my students' money would be the worst. Uh -huh. I can make more! I'll just make more monsters confused until they throw money at me! I you don't owe me shit, I'll just give it to you! Hey, you may have some money, but be mindful of how you spend it. You shouldn't be wasting on services like this. <laughs> this is all for you. I need the money, so I do appreciate you requesting me. However, you're my student, so if we were to get involved further, things would get complicated. It doesn't have to go further! I don't care about that right now! You need money, don't you? I have it! I will give it to you! I did warn you, the rest is your responsibility. You're a high schooler, after all. I can sense Kawakami's trust in me, and I doubt she has a little sister. Or at least one that's in... trouble. It sounds like she herself is in trouble. All right. Uh, three more to go. Oh shit, three more jobs? Or clients? Oh boy. Oh okay. boy. Okay, it looks like I need to take a trip to the Velvet Room and get myself some personas.